so anyways what's up how are you all i hope so that you are fine so today in this video i am going to explain about this project which is based on blockchain firstly let me run this kinash tool if by clicking on quick start so this will work for transaction purpose and i am also using metamask in this project that i am going to explain today so if you have little bit interest in blockchain then i am definitely sure that you like this video and uh, if you want this kind of stuffs like tutorials in my upcoming videos then you really have to subscribe this channel so that you will get notifications and access the free resources available in my channel so let me first of all click on terminal and after clicking on terminal let me move towards the new terminal part so as you all know that we can also access git bash but terminal mostly time i use terminal because it is easy to access so let me first of all reset this uh, project which i am using because i am going to start from starting so that i am use to reset this by using reset command let me click enter after entering then this will take some time to resetting and till then i am going to explain that how exactly ganesh work as you all know that ganesh is a tool if you don't know then i am going to explain that how exactly it works so there are near about 10 uh, addresses which will be provided by this ganesh tool and these all were used for uh, transaction purpose and practice purpose like as you all know that ether is not a free resource it, it is a paid one so this is the tool which will provide ether for transaction purpose for free and this is not a real money as you know that this money will be detected for now just because i am i am having some transaction in my background right now because resetting cost is also utilized by ganesh tool okay so let me install the validity version okay so that we will access this project and run this project smoothly so the version i am using is 0.5.16 let me press enter and it will install the solc tool within 5 or 8 seconds till then let me explain about this other more so this kind of stuffs which will be available online is only for practicing purpose as i have told you earlier and here is the key which will be utilized in metamask earlier bias or if you don't know that what how to use this kind of keys i am here to assist you with so our npm install as well is done now let me run this project into my browser npm run dev is the command to run the project automatically in our browser so as you can see over here it will automatically load my computers who have stand like tom and jerry these were the persons who is having their name into the voting positions and they will compete with each other and say that who won okay so i like tom very much so i am going to pay my vote to tom with the help of this address so this address is from ganesh tool as you can see over here zero multiply 0x 1e and 9e 04 0x 1e 9e 04 so this is the address of ganesh tool coming from ganesh so let me proceed with my port to tom as you can see over it lo it's loading and uh, it's done let me refresh so as you can see over here my port goes to tom and some amount will be deducted from here as well so let me try to vote again to tom is it possible one person to vote twice tries so that it he, 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 tom won no it's not possible let us try when i try to click over here then to this address 
I am not able to vote twice. In second time, I am not able to vote. So this is the blockchain. It means if one hash will transit to the another hash, then he or she will not be able to transit twice or thrice with the same hash. We have to change the hash or values or everything else, but this will need some time so that with this address there is no transaction to exist. So let me run this project with the help of MetaMask. Let me open my Chrome. If you want to learn this kind of uh, project that how we build this kind of project then you have to subscribe to my channel. Definitely I am going to build this uh, stuff online. If you are an Indian then please comment Indian into the comment so that I understand that there are many persons from India and I am going to make videos in Hindi as well. So my voting system start but it's showing loading again and again. Why? Because our MetaMask is not login. So let me login it first. As you can see over here, I have to type the password. Uh, I have to type the second password. So as you can see over here, I have zero ether right now in this account. So let me change the account. So I am I am going to use this kind of address. But for this, I have told you earlier that we need private key to access this address. So this is the private key. Let me copy this and going to MetaMask again. and I am going to as it is showing that connected let me switch to some another account alright so this account will have also zero ether so no transaction will occur let me import account and private key import so here is the 100 ether present of account 0 multiply 0x 094 0x 094 so there are 100 available over here so let me refresh this page so this is showing some other address so let me check what happened so metamask takes some time to open so this is the disadvantage 0x this is the last numbers so let me check 7134 oops let me first firstly open this and then check seven one three four let me connect this active now as you can see over here this is not connected Whenever I refresh this page, then our address will come change to 7134, which is the last digit. 7134. Now, my address is changed. Now I am able to vote again. So let me vote to Jerry this time. So as you can see over here, pop pop-ups comes up automatically. I don't do anything. Whenever I click over here, pop-ups comes up MetaMask. So this is a transaction pop-up. So the, here is the fees that I have to pay. Let me click over here confirm. So my transaction goes well and when I refresh this page, so it's, it shows that Jerry will get one vote again. So it is possible to uh, that I am going to vote again and it will accept my payment. Let us check. I think this is not going to happen because this is a blockchain power that one person cannot vote twice. So it's showing the transfer. This transfer is expected to fail. Try to execute. It is expected to be experienced but fail and is not recommended. If the person will try, I will try anyway. 
if the person try anyway then let's see that what happened confirm oops transaction failed so this is the power of blocking that this is uh, a paired uh, peer to peer transaction cvot etc everything blockchain provides which is really very very secure and helpful for us to know and uh, these kind of project is having more stuff having more ability to uh, increase the security in our upcoming projects so i am going to make these kind of projects again and again so that you understand that how exactly blockchain works so till then bye bye have a nice day goodbye